Speaker. Uh, I rise today in honor of the retirement of Dr. Phil Smith of Nebraska Medicine at the University of Nebraska Medical Center. Over 35 years ago, Dr. Smith established the Nebraska Infection, Con Infection Control uh, Network uh, to educate healthcare professionals regarding infection control in nursing homes and hospitals. Dr. Smith is a pioneer in the field of infectious disease, and his perseverance and dedication led to the establishment of the very critical biocontainment unit at Nebraska Medicine in 2005. Com commissioned by the Center for Disease Control, the unit was at ground zero in the fight against Ebola, providing Ebola training to more than 30 of the country's top hospitals while successfully treating several Ebola patients. Dr. Rick Sacra, who contracted the disease in West Africa, credits the Omaha unit with saving his life. Recently, Dr. Smith co-developed the Center for Preparedness Education, a coalition between the University of Nebraska Medical Center and Creighton University Medical Center. It is important and, and very difficult to sum up this career in, that he has had. What is critical, though, is that the Ebola problem and crisis is not going away. The University of Nebraska Medical Center and the community that I come from, Omaha, Nebraska, and the entire state of Nebraska, is committed to fighting Ebola. We'll continue to do so <clears throat> by developing, developing an even more significant biocontainment center, developing teaching regimens, developing research regimens at the University of Nebraska Medical Center to fight Ebola and other infectious diseases. It is difficult to sum up the career that Dr. Smith has had, but I will quote this. He said, Patient care has been part of my life. It's a noble profession, and nothing beats the gratification of making a diagnosis and helping a patient. Nothing is more clear than the treatment of the Ebola crisis at the University of Nebraska. Saving lives, creating an atmosphere for further research, creating a facility for training for health care professionals from around the world is the mission that the University of Nebraska has taken up. Dr. Smith's contribution to Nebraska and our nation are immeasurable, and we are grateful for his service.